For example, some relative vectors. Here we stop that number one. We stop that number one, so let's continue from number two. We have to find the relative vector b a. That's the relative vector of a from b or of a to b. We have to find the relative vector b a. This is where we left off. b a is the same thing as a minus b. So that's o a position vector o a minus the position vector o b. Let me write in column form. If I write in column form, what's the position vector? O A, that's 3, 5. And O B is 3, 3. So 3, 3, 5 minus what? 3, 3. So each of this is the position vector of you know the letters label. This is vector O A and this is vector O B. So to find vector B A, I'll do O A minus O B or A minus B. This gives me 3 minus 3 and 5 minus 3. And that's equal to 0, 2. So the vector B A is equal to 0 I plus 2 J. You can leave it like this or simply write 2 J. Let's go to the next example. Example 3. Uh, question 3. We have to find the vector CD. Vector CD is D minus C. Roman number 3. We have to find the relative vector CD. The relative vector CD is the same thing as D minus C. That's the vector of D from C or the vector from C to D. So we we'll get it by doing D minus C. D minus C means vector O D minus O C. So uh, I'll go ahead now and get the vector O D. What's the position vector of D? O D is the position vector of D. Vector O D from my diagram, let me check, is uh, minus 3i minus 2j. So I'll take that, put it down here. Minus 3i minus 2j minus O C. I think I just used O C somewhere here. Oh no, it's not there. Let's go. O C is five i plus one j. So O C five i five i plus one j. So I put the two together. What does it give me? I'll get minus three minus five and minus two minus one. Be careful with signs here. This will give me minus eight minus three. So vector C D, the relative vector C D is equal to minus 8i minus 3j. I can write it. This is in you know this is in column form. This is writing it in column form. If I like, I could also write it in coordinate form as minus 8i minus 3j. <clears throat> That's vector C D. Now I think we should include diagrams now. CD, let me just show how you know these vectors relate to each other or how they are drawn. CD is the vector from C to D. Where is D on this diagram? D, D, D. C, D. I can see E. I can see A, B, C. But this is a. Uh, okay. Let's go to the next section. I think I've lost D. I will come back to that later. All right. Next is question four. Relative vector G A. Relative vector G A. Roman number four. Relative vector G A. G A is A minus G which means the same thing as the vector o a minus the vector o g so vector o a let me check again what's vector o a 3 i plus 5 j vector o a is 3 i plus 5 j i'll keep that here then vector o g is what let's go back up and 
do it. I'll be writing each one down now. Vector OG is minus 4i plus 1j. Vector OG is what? Minus 4i plus 1j. So to find vector AG, I'll do OA minus OG, which will give me 3 minus minus 4 and 5 minus 1. I'm doing this here. 3 minus minus 4, you know, for x coordinate. And for y coordinates, I'm doing 5 minus 1. So this will give me 3 minus minus 4 is 3 plus 4. 5 minus 1 is what? 4. So vector GA which is the relative vector of a to g is what 7i plus 4j i'll go ahead and draw a diagram for that now 7 4 so that you can see let's go let's draw vector ga ga is the vector from g to a so i'll start at g let me make it let me draw it with the green line start at g and draw the vector to a take note of the direction of the arrow as it is pointed so on and on like that you find the relative vector of each one so you have to do this as your exercise let me write the remaining questions down what are the remaining questions i've got five let's make that the class exercise class exercise find the relative vectors find the relative vectors in these numbers number five is what let me check number five is uh, a e so you just find these remaining relative vectors from five to the end so the vectors are here if you need them so copy this question you post this video right here copy the questions from number 5 to 15 and you know get each position vector from here to do the exercise so for example what i mean is that for vector ae which is question 5 here if you want to do question 5 vector ae that means you need two position vectors you need the position vector of oa question 5 is you have to find relative vector a e so you need oa which is 3i plus 5j and you need oe which is what let me check oe is a uh, oe is my i minus 5j so you also need 1i minus 5j take note that this i is the same thing as 1i so you answer the questions from 5 to 15 as your classwork.